Right, real quick update. Uh, that 15 mil is coming off the water mains in. There's a non-return valve under the floorboards. Uh, that is one of those little mesh filter traps. And uh, to clean it, you just undo that cap. Obviously turn the water off, undo that cap, pull the mesh out and uh, clean it and put it back in. Uh, it then goes up into this mini expansion vessel. Uh, that was a requirement according to the uh, boiler maker. Uh, we've got an H&R uh, Evolve scale reducer in there. Uh, all that does is uh, reverse the polarity of the ions in the water and uh, helps to prevent scale. That's going to go down there along up here and there'll be a valve uh, like the gas one just here and up into the manifold here. Uh, I was just thinking of a little tip. Um, because you need to get this uh, measurement and get that to focus. Uh, I'm not sure it's focused on it, but because you need that measurement just right, uh, it's the other end. Let me show you that. Obviously you've got to allow for the uh, pipe clip. So to get that just right, you can kind of measure and guesstimate the length of copper. But the other thing you can do if you've got some plastic is uh, just cut the plastic out to size and if it needs trimming up, uh, great. Um, you need just a tiny little bit of uh, a gap, um, you know, so it can uh, expand very slightly with the heat. Um, uh, but it's a lot easier just to trim the plastic pipe down uh, and then once that's the right size you can uh, take it out and uh, cut a piece of uh, copper exactly the right size without uh, faffing around too much. So uh, yeah, that's where we are today. Uh, obviously that's uh, silicon, it's not silicon, it's frame sealant. Um, that's just going to be painted the same colour as the walls. And that was all inside uh, the cupboard, which will be uh, just finished off in that plasterboard and skimmed over probably, and uh, and just painted. Um, so yeah, just a quick update. I thought that was a handy tip. Uh, much easier to cut the plastic down. Uh, if you get that wrong, it doesn't matter. There's plenty more of it. And uh, once you've got the right length, just pull it off, cut the copper to the same size. Catch you later.